Hello, my fellow Enclave brothers and sisters. I'm Mr. Mocha Lover, and thank you for rejoining me here, of course, in Old World Blues, playing as that thicker Enclave. So, last time we took out a few nations, those in the Antelope tribes, those in Vault City, and that little NCR that we helped take out. So, I'll be honest here, this is a beast deal. This is a little gamey. I'm going to be completely honest. This is a little gamey. I gave the Veil Bandits so much territory up here, mostly because I did not want to border with the uh, Steel Rangers. That's pretty much why. Now, the Western Brotherhood pretty much got this chunk of territory from the NCR, which makes sense. Uh, the, Steel Brother the Steel Rangers got territory down here because they deserved a little bit. Honestly, maybe they didn't deserve all of this, but because I gave some of my score to the Veil Banditos, they ended up getting Wood Lake, which basically guarantees that we won't I have to really pick a fight with these guys because, well, I can't afford a two-front war. So that being said, let us let time go on, but first we must choose our next national focus. Also, I did say at the end of the last episode I was going to just auto-do extend presidential powers, so it's already done. And we can reclaim the Californian army bases, which will give us materials and resources and equipment from those supply caches. That being said, we could, of course, do the ranger question. But, War with the Brotherhood, which gives us the war goal against them, and some more war support. So, the Brotherhood of Steel is an old enemy of ours. While the distance between us has kept them off our mind, that time has passed. They will no longer be a threat to the existence of the United States once we are done with them. And right now we got to kind of wait, because we have soldiers in their territory, and the Banditos territory, which is fine with us. Currently, we are still mobilizing, which is great. Sac City Remnants. After the fall of Navarro, many survivors tried their luck at integrating into the NCR. While a large number were found out and arrested, many more successfully began their new lives in Sac City. Those people and their descendants have now petitioned to join us or rejoin the Enclave. Welcome back. They turned their backs on the Enclave. Hmm. You know what? We don't have that many numbers of pure humans, and these people might still be humans. We... We need as many humans as we can get, because cloning, while we're trying to get to there, it might not be perfect. I think that this will be okay. Ah, screw it. Just turn the facts on them. On them. Who cares? The fall of Sac City. The once beautiful city of Sacramento is now a ruined, occupied city, which is occupied, of course, by mutant squatters. Its liberation is a great victory for the Enclave in America. We have even managed to free some of our long-lost brothers and sisters from the mutants' prisons. Good. Oh, there you go. Oh, that fired. Cool. Yeah, we... Saved them, and then we got rid of them. Cool, whatever. N nothing to see here. Nothing to see here, my friends. 2.15 every single day. So, a couple comments from yesterday. Let's talk about our specialization tree with the, uh, you know, land doctrine, specialized warfare. Overall, people recommended that I choose the right side, just so we get more buffs. We might not be able to make as much power armor, but we get even stronger power armor. More defense, more soft attack, more hard attack. Overall, this would be a good thing to do. Uh, let's come over here. And we will choose... Get some more breakthrough first. That'll be good for special units. Someone also recommended that I keep quantity for now to keep producing more equipment. Which is actually not a bad idea. Because we should get, like, a massive stockpile of power armor, which we currently have. And then maybe eventually, like, towards very late game, we'll switch it over to quantity, which should do okay. Uh, use medical equipment. Uh, I wasn't so clear on this one. Using medical equipment. There's a focus for that, I believe. I don't exactly remember where that was. Lessons from the Great War. That would be good to do. Strike Team Doctrine. Ooh. Formalize the Forces. That's not bad. Uh, we'll talk about that in a little bit. Uh, FEV. Tlalox Designs. Yeah, I wasn't so sure about medical equipment. I mean, I do need to put some guys, some medical equipment on our infantry. Because these guys are pretty pretty bare right now, to be honest with you. Even though we really can't afford too much. Chem companies, that would be nice. Dogs help them with the breakthrough, which... Oh, let's get some dynamite first. Oh, that's all we can really afford. That's fine with me. We definitely need more factories because 12... Well, to be honest with you, 12 really isn't cutting it that much. Let's go with that right there. Ooh, yeah, we really need more military factories, not gonna lie. We definitely need some more. Hmm. Unfortunate, but oh well. And someone asked why did I research gliders yesterday? It's because you have to get you have to research gliders to get to the whole air, aerial warfare, which is cool. And then I need anti-tank for piercing. But unfortunately, we don't have enough factories for that. And I don't think I can transfer factories over just because I don't have, really, that much Lawless Wasteland left. Let me go grab that real quick. I don't think I really have any Lawless Wasteland. I mean, we have this. I did this yesterday. But I don't think I can transfer that. There's no button here I see that can 
that we can transfer these broken factories to uh, our capital of the Sierra Army Depot. So, even here, I mean, we, we are still garrisoning these areas pretty darn well. Like, we are we are on exploit resources. Oh, wait, we can hmm. hmm. Oh, we can, oh, there it is. Okay, so now we need to use, we are on exploit resources, but we need to go to dismantle industry. Hmm. Is there a button here? Dismantle. Click to convert. Oh, War with the Brother, that's good to get done first. Let's reclaim the Army, Californian Army bases. The NCR is illegally occupying most, many U.S. military bases. Once we have reclaimed them, we can get to excavating them and recovering whatever was not yet looted by the mutants. Good, we got some political power. Do we really need to use it on anything? Begin a scavenging program, we might do that. We do need more caps. Oh, we can salvage stuff. Ah, oh, so you can exploit the waste by using your command power. So, less than 50% res resistance. Active for 25 days, effects when move, remove two, two our arms workshops, and then an antelope reservation, and that'll be given to someone else. Arms factories, industry. Ooh, do I want, hmm. Denio Modoc. Well, let's see. We only have so many slots here. As much as I would want more military factories, or civilian factories, I think military factories are where we're going to have to do it. Let's go do that first. Military factories it is. So that's going to be two. That's one arms, one arms. Uh, yeah. We're going to do that too. That's fine. And that'll happen within 25 days. No longer get the effects of vengeance, which is fine. Cool. You know what? I'll just put them all in there. That's fine. I, just, I, I don't care. Whatever. Uh, here. So let's keep that on until we can get rid of that. No compliance gain. Actually, it. We could probably try to see this. Enslave the locals. We get more. Do we? Can we actually get? Like, we can get. Um, if we get one percent compliance a day, that might be a little broken, to be honest with you. I don't think that we should really be doing this since. Ooh, Crimson Acolytes Clear One Chemical Station, which is nice. This doesn't seem very Enclave-like when we're going purists, but you know what? Maybe I'll maybe I'll take this. Maybe I'll take this. Awesome. Okay, I'm the bases. I mean, if it's available, you might as well use it, right? Let's have the lessons from the war, though. The war against NCR is unlike any conflict the Enclave has engaged in for centuries. It is a wake-up call for our generals to reinvent their doctrines or risk the total destruction of humanity. And we also get a boost to our power armor cap. That is actually not bad, since... We can use their soldiers. Hmm. That really doesn't seem very Enclave-like, to be honest with you. But since it's here, we might as well take it and use it, right? Uh, we're not building anything that we need. We're tr actually building close air support. Wow. We're actually doing okay-ish here. I do want more gunships. But I do kind of want to make some planes as well. Some better fighters. Because enemies will be using fighters eventually, so... But, let's see... We won't need protect ones if we get more of this. Make more gunships. I, I love gunships so much. Cool. And Chief of Navy. We don't need to think about that. Logistics. Uh, mm, mm, more air support. Sure, why not? Let's get some more air support. Because we can. Cool. So, Sierra Army Depot. Where do we move all this stuff? Secure the airbase. We get 300 units of Enclave Scavenge Power Armor. That's fine with me. Sure, why not? Oh, restore Beale Air Force Base. Or, get an armor workshop, Naval Air Station, Lemur. Yeah, good. We'll feel that once we're, we create this other division, because we did last time lose a few divisions, which was not very good. I want to make sure that everyone's the same as here as well. Good. Make sure everyone's the same, because 20 combat with power armor divisions are just tasty, tasty. Because these guys are only 10 combat width, these guys are only 10 combat width, which is... You know, that's nice. That's nice, but, you know, we don't really need that. We don't need that either. Enclave PA. This is nice, but it's, it's exactly the same. Ooh, we were making riders as well. Uh, riders. Dogs. There we go. How many divisions of... Eh, we got a little bit, not much. Yeah, that's actually quite interesting. Enslaved locals. Brotherhood operative... Oh, we have ways of making you talk. Br Brotherhood operative. It's like the locals. You know what? If that's so we must have dismantled like all their industry since we no longer. Yeah. Nice. Awesome. You know what? I'm I'm glad I discovered this with you guys. I'm really glad. Let's go back to enslave locals. We must enslave them. 
They might even fight for us, because it's working for the barons. I mean, holy crud. That's awesome. If that's the case, but the NCR, we are going to leave them there. New Reno. That might be a bug. If not, that, hey, that's awesome. All right, cool. Salvage arms, arms workshops, North Coover taking a raid. No one cares about North Coover. Uh, industry one, 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 whatever. Let's see, occupation laws after for five days. Cool, I mean, we might as well use it. Wow, this is not bad. You know what? Screw that. Infinite factories, thank you. Uh, I'll take infinite factories. You know what? Just build up infrastructure then. Build up a ton of infrastructure. Actually, you know what? How many factories do we have here? 12, oh, 12 out of 12, that might not be good. So what are these, so you just literally just dismantle everything and they just go off map. That is, I've been hurting myself this entire game. Holy cow. Go to, this is a lot easier than I thought. Amazing. Now you do have, you see me here, uh, planning some sort of, you know, air raid or air attack. Yeah, I don't know. We might just want to have a little bit more of a drawn out war against these guys. We'll see what happens. I did split these guys up. We got lessons from the Great War. That's nice. Uh, but we might be, I need to be careful about that. Uh, deal with the Yakuza. Not yet. God bless the Enclave. What we're going to do next is either formalize the forces or strike, strike team draw doctrine. I can't, I can't word. Oh, we can produce things so much faster if we go this way. Drop training. Even more pair drops. Well, we'll use pair drops for a while. We might not use it all the time, though. Elite support. Flexible battle plans. That's okay. Or formalize the forces. Land doctrine bonuses. Oh, look at that organization. Air supremacy. Fighters. Air superiority. Oh, we get... Oh, I have to go that way. Because you gotta get fighters. Those fighters are so good. We get even more... Oh, supply consumption. Oh, I have to go formalize the forces. So, the Enclave command structure was always geared towards surgical strikes and limited deployment. If we're to wage total war, we must reform ourselves for that purposes. Yes, we are taking a different doctrine, different path this time. You guys are robos. Cool. Uh, if you guys need to train, we're not going to go to war yet, since we're still literally dismantling. Oh my god, we can take all these and then go... Uh, this is broken. This is completely broken. I love it. I don't know where we're putting all these factories, but you know what? Bring it on, man. Just bring it on. We get 0.9 a day. Mineral drinkers. Kimmel station. Nice. Look at those guys. God, I love this Enclave coffee I've got here, but Jesus. The Brotherhood has definitely made a mistake going to war with the NCR and not trying to kill me off earlier. Oh my god, this is... This is broken. Ah, Veil Banditos. Yes, yes, you can... Have that. You can not have slaves. Uncultured, they believe in slavery. Awesome. Alright, so... I'm not... We haven't taken all the things out of here yet. I and mean, we are losing a little bit of manpower by doing this, but... Let's double check this real quick. So, we have dismantled, dismantled, enslaving them. The cost that's needed is going down every single day. 0 0.09, 0 0.08, 0 0.06. Broken. Completely broken. I love this. I love enslaving locals. I can say that. We're not in the first five to ten minutes of, on YouTube here. Cool. We're releasing this video. Good, good, good. Get more reliability. Grab some more of that. Yeah, I like it when they attack harder. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We're going to do all this stuff first, and then we're just going to enslave them and have a great time. Next up, Scorched Earth Doctrine. More breakthrough, more soft attack, more special forces capacity multiplier. Perfect. Just, I couldn't ask for more. Couldn't ask for more. Formalize the forces. Good. And Citrus. Ooh, I love that one. F-85 fighters, you really, you can't get to them normally. Um, we can get to nuclear jet fighters. F, uh, F-85 fighters. Am I missing them? Transport food chips. I think that's what this is. No? No, maybe not. I don't know. I still want to do it anyways. So, 
Air Supremacy. Let's do that one first. So, for decades, the Enclave rules the skies uncontested. In our absence, the mutants have gotten their own clunkers off the ground. The VVO2s were never meant to be to compete for air superiority and are sitting ducks to even the most primitive of airplanes. We will reclaim the American skies before reclaiming the American soil. Yes. Oh, good God. Oh, we need more resources. Can we get any more resources, please? No? Okay. If that's the case, we're just going to keep building up as much infrastructure as possible everywhere. Because, first of all, I this is like an infrastructure-based toy for channel. So, that'd be awesome. But secondly... I can't think of what I'm saying anymore. Cool. So, we're going to grab you then. Research speed. Love it. We need... Oh, that's what I want to think. That's what we want. Yeah, that's good. Good stuff. Dynamite. Yeah, we're going to need some more composite stuff. And we shall grab... Fortifications. No, we don't need that. Infrastructure. Yeah, let's grab that because we're building infrastructure. Words. Difficult. Hard. Meaning. Yes. Hello! <laughs> So how is this coming along? Can we definitely deploy that? Can we just make them all? Just make them all as fast as you possibly can. That'll be good. That'll be good. Can we still deploy this? Even if... Good. I think we can, which is awesome. You know, just get out. We can't really train this because that's what put us over our cap, which is fine. Because we can still deploy another general, another unit here, which would be good. Actually, I'm probably not going to paradrop. I'm probably just going to end up sitting here defending against the Brotherhood for a while, because we kind of want to see the Brotherhood struggle. Let's be real. Uh, I really don't want to make another here, army group here. It's fine. You know what? We're not going to do that, because we're going to need some serious firepower to help defeat the Brotherhood. You guys come here. Up there. You guys. Come down here. I'll blow out the robots, because you're going to need it. You're going to dig in forever. Woo! Let's see. Yeah, uh, we could do that, but that's going to hurt our production of that stuff. Guns are okay. We're not going to really do too, do too much there. We're going to get some more of the crowd control gear that helps oppress people. Uh, we'll do that. We'll do, definitely do this. Pecos Colony declared war on Estado de Texas. Cool. What are the legions going to do now? Let's see. We get any more factories. I mean, we could throw that there. That's fine with me, but it's not like we can do that much there. That'd be good. Train, train, train. We need more army XP. We need some more command power. Let's spend it. Nice. That's awesome. That's just really awesome. 41 factories as the Enclave. And we now have air supremacy. Advanced fighter projects. Oh, yeah. If we're to become the indisputed masters of the American skies, we must focus our efforts on making a technological leap in fighter technology. Absolutely. Let me get this. One more, and then we're going to convert all, every place pretty much over that we haven't done yet to enslave the locals just it's just a casual enslavement that's all that's all you know uh, we can begin a scavenging program mm, but that's gonna cost caps I don't want to hurt my caps too much uh, what can we do here we really don't need any of this war support goes up war support goes up factory output goes down for more war support yeah that's not really worth it there we go beautiful let's switch this over and Mexico's on fire but whatever enslave locals dismantle I think we already did this one, so let's enslave locals. I think we did all of this already, so just, you know what? Enslavement for all. That is, that is beautiful. We, oh my god, that's so good. Did we, wait, Do we already just, I guess we took all the resources possible. Did we, we stripped clean all of the resources, all the areas that we fought so hard for. Holy cow, that is awesome. Now, I see in this, I'm not liking what I see. Uh, you know what, before we do anything else. Uh, riders, you require 125. How many pieces of equipment do we have? 153, that's not bad. Let's go ahead and begin switching this over to riders. Riders. I'm going to avoid the NCR for now. That should be good. Rider equipment, infantry armor. That's, Jesus, that's, that's not bad. Yoda hospitals. Riders. Riders, good. Now, I'm thinking... I don't want to do this, but we're going to need some places for defenses. For Coast Guards, for now, I'm going to use this division. Uh, Uncle Adira, it doesn't really matter. Just because the Brotherhood does have a navy. Uh, you know what? No, screw it. I'm not going to give into that. No. There you go. If they come by, they'll come by. Whatever. Let them come in. Oh, we got some more research I can do. Whoops, my bad. There we go. I'm ready for more territory. We have 53 factories! 50 freaking 3! That's so good! 
We got cams, we got recon, we got demo. Uh, oh, we need anti-tank. We gotta get that anti-tank. And we are out of anti-tank, are we? No. Let's make sure everyone trains, because that is incredibly important. For you guys, I don't mind putting you guys where there are ports. You'll be fine up there. Really, the only other port is right here. Good. We have advanced fighter projects. We have... Ah, oh, we do have the 85 fighter. Good. And Mexico's on fire. Let's get some centralized command. Enclave assault squads have always enjoyed a great deal of autonomy in the field, but that was a different scale of warfare than what we were faced with. From now on, all field commanders will be directed by the sharpest minds of the Enclave High Command. We get 20% more organization, more planning, max planning, more maximum command power increase, starting planning skill level of new army leaders, equipment capture ratio modifier, and daily elite support. Muy bueno, as they probably don't say in the Enclave. Deploy them immediately. I want to use them. I want more. Ooh, army XP. Or, uh, air XP. Air XP. Oh, look at those guys. Beautiful. You guys are over there. Four divisions honestly should be good enough. You guys... I really don't want to do this, but... We'll have another army then. As much as I think that the infantry should be able to hold with power armor, that's pretty much guaranteed to hold. Should be pretty much guaranteed. Cool. Expl yeah, let's go, Life Giver. I don't want to lose that many guys around here. Good. Good. And Major General Grimm. Infantry, infantry, ninja, more recon. You guys don't have any recon, yeah. I, uh, engine thrusters. Flexible. That's not bad. Out of supply. At more attack. Let's get more attack. I like more attack. And recon would not really be helpful there. Out of supply. Ah, go with negotiator. Once we get enough command power. There we go. Boom. Let's move and do that. Nice. Field the veterans. Well, I'm trying to deploy them as fast as I can. Let's see. We can still deploy these guys. Yeah, we can still deploy them. Nice. Oh, crud. Look at that. We've got some free dockyards. Wow. Transfer will be done in eight months. Nice. Got some convoys finally. Do we have any other air bases? You guys are standing by. We have no extra planes so far, which is really disappointing. Ah, I need more planes. We can only afford so much. Marksmanship doctrine. Cool. Get more defense. All right. So are you guys done training yet? No, but you guys pretty much are. We're going to go to war very, very soon. You guys are training right here, which will be fine. That's 17 divisions. Enclave division power armor stuff should be able to hold out, but... Go ahead and get ready. Scorched Earth, and we shall finish our land doctrine with shock and awe. More air superiority, more training time. more 10% so more soft attack and hard attack, and just slightly more supply use. Wowzers. Defenses are online to get a few fighters. How great. But casually, just a few more fighters. Air, Chief of Air Force. Ooh, bad weather. Oh, yeah. Let's maximize that. War industrialist dockyards. This looks... It's all okay. Um... Uh, Outposts? And that's not bad. Yeah, I'll go with Sedgwick, why not? For you guys, we'll just go with no yeah. Oh, that's uh, that's 150. Centralized command, good. And now we can ask well, let's get the war goal against Carson City for now, that'd be fine. So the only thing worse than mutants is four mutants. Let us waste no time in removing this criminal infestation from our soil. Good. We get a scavenging program. Alright, uh, I think our guys look pretty good. Not gonna lie, they look pretty good. I'm gonna lose so many close air support planes here. It's not even funny. So you get up there, you're defending that little beach. Ooh, five divisions. They're defending over a waterway, and these guys already have anti-tank on them, even though we will not probably be able to pierce their armor. But, oh well, let's see what happens. Yep, and numbers immediately going up. Steel Rangers. Can you guys pierce me? Oh, you're not even fighting. Oh, no, the Enclave is fighting. Oh, they're bombarding us too. Uh, up, and they're trying to attack us, which is fine. We're getting quite a bit of air XP, even with no fighters. That's a lot of... I love gunships. Gunships are just... Oh, I love gunships so much. Oh. And the Brotherhood. While they may have some sort of technological prowess, they are just big dum-dums. Big dum-dums when it comes to warfare. It's amazing they survived this long. 5,000 manpower and reserve? Well, that's not going to last forever. But, you know, I have not asked you this question yet. Intelligence. You know I'm going to ask you in the comments already. What is the agency name going to be? I don't know. I really don't know. Like, 
Oh, Secret Enclave Society, the SES. That's okay. That doesn't sound great. Let me know in the comments below because you guys come up with some really good names for agency names. Please let me know in the comments below. Oh, this probably wouldn't work for an American first type of uh, agency. Uh, what screams American to me? I like the sword for this one. I like the globe because America will be global. So, mm, that seems not quite right. Yeah, let's, let's go with that. So, but let me know in the comments below a name, a good, strong, powerful name that the Enclave would use to describe their intelligence agency. Before we move on, can they pierce me? That's a good question to ask. That's always a good question to ask. No, they can't. Well, the infantry is getting hurt, <clears throat> and I'd rather not use them. Ooh, we're building the waste. It is what it is. So, I want to say with maximum infrastructure, good. 3,121, that's not bad. But this is a necessary evil because we got to get to Navarro. Once we get Navarro and we can start successfully cloning things, it's all over. It's endgame. It's not, well, it's not endgame the movie, you know, but it's, it's endgame. Uh, air support mission efficiency. Oh, wait, we want to make some fighters. Yeah, oh, yeah. Fighters. Oh, how we can even make them better. Uh, give them more range, give them more engine power, but we, we, we really can't afford that, so there we go. Wait. Design is... Oh, we only have 30. I was looking at my bottle caps. I thought that's how much our air XP we had. Deal with the Yakuza, and we'll have the Ranger question. We have come to border a parody of pre-war U.S. Rangers. We should prepare for the risk of them aligning themselves with the NCR, or Brotherhood, pulling us into a two-front war. Now, I... Uh, nope. 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 No, thank you. Uh, few of the veterans. Well, I mean, these guys are coming along. It says we're always going to be losing, but... God bless the Enclave. 54 flipping factories. That's amazing. The Ranger question. More war support? Good. Now, we can either push through the Rangers. We get a war goal against them. We get attack bonus. Improving our supply lines. Infrastructure, which is okay. I'm already building infrastructure. Infrastructure construction speed. I... I don't even want to look at the other ones. I want that one so much. Desert training. Oh, that's not bad. Plan our attacks. Anti-ranger attack plan. Or hold the line. Get defense, stability, research in line. Outposts. I'm not using outposts. We could sabotage infrastructure. No. We're going we're gonna to push straight through the rangers. So, a lightning strike through the rangers could bring us straight to the gates of the capital of the NCR. We should make preparations for a strong push and for the challenges of fighting an offensive war through a desert. It's absolutely possible we can do it. Don't tell us that we cannot. We have the scientists. We have so many scientists. We even have enclave scientists, which we pulled soldiers away from the front for more science. I love enclave coffee. Oh. Woo! Office of... You know, that's a pretty not fun name. Uh, cryptology department. That'd be nice. But not, not super necessary. Does anyone have uh, upgrades? Yep. Any upgrades? No? Okay. Upgrades for you guys, maybe, maybe not. Nerd Rage, Jack, Shadow Jack, Jack Shadow leading infantry. Yeah, that can kind of wait. We might get something better. You guys are doing robots. Y'all are doing night person would be. Eh, you know what? Actually, we'll do night person because that can apply whenever we attack, which would be good. Enclave guys, you guys are over here. Put your armament. You guys are up down there. You're still getting attacked. Oh, you guys can come down there. That's fine with me. Research is next, and we shall grab you. I totally forgot we had guys down here. Yeah, five infantry divisions should be able to hold out pretty darn well. We can even pierce them, which is nice. Oh, oh, that is not looking good. Hmm, I'm glad I'm sending another division down there. If that's the case, you guys come down here. And I'll send these uh, divisions to help out the area down here as well. Foxhole Doctrine, good. Let's grab some more of that, too. Thank you. Wow, so much political power. What am I going to do with this stuff? Oh, we're going to restore the Beale Air Force Base. Cost us cats, but that's okay. Once these guys are done, we might not be able to make any more. Make as many as you can. Form the department. Thank you, Cryptology. Oh, we can do the Brotherhood, but it's going to take so long, it doesn't even matter. You know, just, just do a lot of people, because I really don't care about Cryptology that much. It's a nice 15% breakthrough, but at this point in the game, it won't matter that much. Enclave, Peter Travis, Benjamin Scott. Yeah, I do some counterintelligence, that'd be nice. Push through the Rangers, good. And we're going to improve our supply lines. Supp supplying an army pushing through a desert is a challenge we must be prepared to face. Improving our existing supply lines will be invaluable when time comes. Uh, what are the losses like? Like 330? That's quite a few for the Enclave. 
But where we're going, we probably don't need it nearly as much. Shock and awe. Oh my god, everyone gets more soft attack. Get some Mr. Handies because we can. Because I mostly feel like it. And you guys are getting down there. Please, for the love of god. When, when are you guys going to be done? June 2nd. So in like two weeks, we got another guy here. Shadow Jack Churchill. I will throw on Enclave Divisions just to help you guys out. Because Enclave our Power Armor Divisions are just needed for this. These guys must be like running out of manpower. Oh, they're already out. Nice. They can't keep this up. Which is a good thing. You know what? Oh, even we're hurting here a little bit too. Well, that's not bueno. Let me see. Hmm. Can two divisions supported by six divisions win in this case? Can they pierce me? No. Good. Help out to these guys down here. Uh, you guys are right there. Get involved. You know what? I'm going to pull half you guys out, just so we don't lose any more guys here. There you go. Stay right there. The power armor won't be able to get broken right there, so... Not really worried about it. Oh, yeah, we can... Even the Enclave divisions can pierce the enemy's power armor and other guys. Two power armored guys? Can they... Can they smash through? I hope so. For the love of God, I really, really... Oh, oh yeah. There you go. Nice. White Claws, to put a war on some other people. Good. We still have that war goal against White Claws. This will be a full conquest, uh, full wasteland conquest in this campaign, which would be nice. Would be a little bit fun. What do I do with my power, my political power? Power armor is no problem, but political power? Like, like I really don't have much to do. We can feel more veterans, but I'm waiting to make more veterans. More guys, good. Advanced tools, lessons, lessons. Lessons from construction. Our engineers have gained plenty of practical experience building infrastructure in the last few months. We can cement their knowledge by requesting that they document their findings properly. Good. Uh, anything here? Resource extraction, we'll grab some of that because we can. Awesome. Now we could push through here, but I really need these guys to push up here too. Uh, Plane-wise, we have a little bit of a de Oh, oh, oh. That's not good. Uh, lower you to medium. Reinforcement, set that to high. Because I want to make sure that our power armor in the field is taken care of enough. You know what? You guys, just come right there. All we really need is just probably two power armor divisions to hold out. That's probably all we need. Stratified attack patterns, good. Mm, we're going to grab some of that. Strategic bombing doesn't even matter, but we'll, we'll grab it anyways. Good, good, good. Over here, Chief of Navy. Capital ship attack, defend, good, yes. Muy bueno, yes. Oh, can we get even... Oh, we can get more, but it hurts our construction speed output. The final line. Man, if we gotta go to the final line, that is... That is not good. Builds battleships. Max range. Just go and grab that, too. Heavy trooper open. Nice. More organization. Preemptive strikes. We're done down here. Let's grab some of this. And then we're gonna grab some of this. Let the power armor hold for now. 400 some losses. That's fine. They've lost 12,000. Not enough. Never enough. Advanced communications. Hmm. 63 divisions. Well. Oh, Heaven's Gate. Oh, well, there goes the 80s. Well, that sucks. White Claws are looking pretty thick, though. Well, I guess it's time for us to actually do something about this. Alright. Well, we only have 50 of these guys left. They're not doing too much. Well, time to take out Northwest California. Lessons from construction. I love it. And desert training. Deserts require a change in military tactics and protocol. With the right training, we can prepare our soldiers for these challenges, and it's time to kill off our enemies. With a little bit of help from our planes. You guys should have, like, almost no problem beating up these guys, especially with uh, close air support. Uh, flamethrower add-ons, good. Another Enclave Division. You know, don't even get involved, just come up there. The power armor's got it taken care of. Nice. Very good. You guys are doing a great job up here. Keep it up. Smash them to bits. They don't need life where they're going. Just start researching as many different things as you can. Oh, there goes the uh, Mormons. Uh, they're going up north doing stuff. You might as well help out, help them out and just smash, smash. Charles Beatty. Gun nut, infantry, meh. Strong back, out of supply. Ah, yes. Las Holandesas del Variantato. I cannot word correctly sometimes. Oh, is it not? Well. They have signed their death wish. There we go. Move on in. And I'm going to request maybe that one of these guys just go straight to, towards Navarro. Mr. Handy. Cool. Link up if you can, man. That'd be great. Oh, yeah. Oh. 
Well, establish an outpost. Beautiful. And this is ours now. Thank you, thank you, thank you for playing. I love the lawless wasteland. Oh, they can't do anything here. That's awesome. Actually, we can still do this. Put some robots here. How many robots we got? Oh, we got plenty. So we don't have to garrison as much with uh, our guys. So they have a little bit on uh, manpower, which is kind of nice. Because manpower is slowly going down. So we really need to get to Navarro. Uh, where do these guys go? You know what? Oh, you guys are just hanging out. You know what, at this point? All of you guys? Just come here. Smash them to hell and back. Go, go, go. Even though they come through here, that's fine. Uh, I'm surprised they haven't navally invaded, so get the robots up here too. That's fine with me. Desert training, good stuff. And plan our attack. So, while no plan survives contact with the enemy, having one does tend to help our soldiers just do that. Yes. Now, of course, we'll have increasing casualties, but they've already lost 15,000 supply-wise. They must be doing absolutely terrible. If these guys are smart, they might attack um, or encircle us, but... Yeah, they ain't that smart. If you guys are up here... You know what? I'm just going to transfer, transfer all these guys over here, actually. Good. I'm going to put you guys right here. Help all the lines well. Because Navarro is really what we're aiming for right now. Good, good, good. Because these guys, the main forces, are just trying to drive through here as fast as possible. While eliminating all opposition. Alright, so occupied territories. What we're going to do with these guys is like locals. We could exploit more resources because we will get that eventually. We'll see what happens first. This is still technically NCR territory, which has probably a few factories here and there. You guys, no upgrades. Oh, what the heck? Oh, it's turned into Lawless Wasteland. That's fine. Oh, that's, actually, that's, that's not fine. Hold on. Oh, Lawless Wasteland, why won't you do this to us? Boop. There you go. Keep going, keep going, no worries. And we shall do that. Thank you. Oh, they took all that extra territory. God dang it, that sucks. You know what? You guys are attached. Just go ahead. You should... Yeah, you'll be able to get through these guys quickly. We've beaten up enough soldiers that even the supply really is garbo around here. We gotta do that. Um, even the infantry can do well, so. Virgin spies, good. Another spy, good. Uh, smoocher, Stonewall. Stonewall Smoocher. Good. Let the infantry move out and do their thing. You guys are holding well down there. Ah, another lawless wasteland? Sure, we'll gladly take it. Thank you. White Claws declare one of dead horses. Oh! They have their own power armor right through there. That's gonna die. I'd rather just like have you all just beat them up and kill them off here. But you know what? I'm glad we I'm glad we do have some infantry here. Uh, I do appreciate all that you're doing. Just come on down here, and help out, plan our attacks. Good, and we're done with that. Really, we can do some anti-brotherhood propaganda. Ooh, silence Congress. Emergency draft. Well, we could do that, but that doesn't seem really necessary. So, anti-brotherhood propaganda. Though our younger members may not remember their crimes against us at Navarro, we have many reasons to seek the destruction of those power-armored Boy Scouts. Let us compile our grievances into broadcasts to remind our soldiers of why we fight. Uh, go ahead and do that. That's fine. Anti-ranger attack plan. Oh, we can get some more attack, but that's be kind of useless for us right now. God dang it. This lawless wasteland is kind of eating me up. There you go. Really, I want you to focus mostly down here. We really need to get to Navarro quickly. Uh, that's fine. Kill them off right here. That's fine. If they take a lot of this territory, it doesn't really matter to us. And they declared war on the she. Oh, god dang it. Yeah, this is getting really annoying. At this point, just come over here as well. Oh, crap. That was a bad idea. Uh, you guys come back here. Good, good. Okay, go that way, and then grab that. Insa. Fences are online, good stuff. Mr. Handy's, and well, whatever. 
these guys up if you can. Don't let them move. Do not let them move. We've linked up, actually, with these guys. The Shi are expanding as well. Not bad. So many pauses. So many things like that. Oh, look, overran. Beautiful. Just beat them up. Take them out. You know, the normal stuff. Ah, another power armor division. Oh, they left. Actually, add them down here just because... Looks like they want to get encircled. Great. Thank you. Alright, so now we can add them back up to this group here, which is fine. Which I tried to do earlier, but they don't really work out that well. Whee! But we gotta make sure we get Navarro. And the peace deal, we totally will, so... Oh, and we have this. So, we shall do... Silence Congress. The Enclave President has always shared some power with the Congress of Representatives. While our equivalent was a symbolic institution at the best, their word nonetheless carried some power, and their suggestions were noted. It is high time they fall in line. Ah, yes. Anti-Rangers, nothing really... Oh, anti-Brotherhood propaganda. Ah, you might as well grab that. Police Protectrons, good. Ah, we could raise that, we could get rid of this, but this helps us with Justify War Goals times. Nah. 8% more is not bad, but eh. Bit of a waste. Mark 2's, good. And of course, this would take away from us, of course. Where else are they doing that? Oh god dang, the she really want Navarro, but yeah. In the peace deal, we are totally gonna get it. Please go straight for Navarro. Don't let them... No! No! Ah, oh, god dang it. Don't make me commit war crimes. Cool. Uh, y'all. Come over there. That'd be good. God dang it. There's a man. Seriously. Should not have called in the lawless wasteland, but it is what it is. You know, whatever. Captured Lost Hills Bunker. Great. Salvage motorcycles. Love it. Salvage those thingies, my bothers. Don't tell me we're going to get cut off. Can you capitulate them? No. You guys are all done. Good. Come on down here now. Select all. Hold and come. Go. Go. Uh, make sure we don't get encircled. No, 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 no. Silence Congress. I love silencing Congress. Emergency draft. Yeah, we can get more manpower, but, you know, we're still pretty good right now. We could always remove it later, but I'm not going to do that. For, but for now, since we're mostly done with our, you know, focuses, let's grab... I could get resistance, but I'm going to grab construction engineering so we can just build more. I love building things. Air Force Space, cool. Army Depot. The fall of some nation that we don't care about? Great. Oh, you wanted to die? Okay, yeah, go ahead and die. It's time to die. You guys are at such a high risk for getting capitulated. Or getting encircled and destroyed. It's not good to see that. Alright. And we will finish this episode off with the destruction of the Brotherhood. And these guys will move. Mm, not yet. They're still fighting these guys. Industrial fertilizers, nice. Good. Oh, god dang it. Don't throw, throw on the other robots, it's fine. Let him move, let him move. Oh, where do we have... Oh, Alright, so I do want to... I'll, I will divide these armies up again, so to make it... Uh, power armor division under one army group, and the other power armor... And then everyone else under another group, so... And there they go. What's some brotherhood? The lawless wasteland has already taken all that stuff. Cool. Uh, we'll just divide this up for now, even though I do technically, I guess, own this territory. Whatever. The she, they did do some work, so they'll be the first ones probably to die around here. And that's pretty much all they're going to get. Well, we get... Oh, we also get the Steel Rangers. I didn't even realize that. I'm not connected to the territory at all. That's not going to be good. But that's where we're going to end today's episode, my friends. It's a new year, 2281, and I hope you enjoyed today's episode. Gorgonia.
cool. But like I said, hope you enjoyed it. If you did, consider leaving a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below. And I'll see you all tomorrow after I read your comments about what we should rename our intelligence agency. Thanks for watching, though, and have a great rest of your day.